The NFL is telling us without really telling us that they messed up with QBs. We live in a world right now where 16 quarterbacks are making north of $30 million. That's half the league, and it includes guys like Derek Carr, Daniel Jones, Baker Mayfield, and Kirk Cousins. The idea that every competent QB is up for a contract should reset the market was never sustainable. The QBs who will change this are Dak and Tua. Both are on the last year of their deals, and naturally, they want market rate extensions. Now, their agents are asking for something similar to what Jalen Hurts and Lamar Jackson got, $50 million per year. The problem here isn't that I think Dak and Tua suck. They both can win you games. The problem is they're closer to the middle class of QBs and that class has dwindled down to just one guy. Geno Smith, who gets paid $25 million per year. He's the only QB in the 20s. He's sandwiched between Baker, who makes $33 million, and Jordan Love, who makes $13 million and is still in his rookie deal. The Dolphins and Cowboys have finally had enough. They're refusing to treat Dak and Tua like they're Mahomes and Allen, and it's the right move long term. I'm Fred Michael Smith, and that's my take.